Well, good morning. Welcome to my studio. This is Nancy. I'm getting ready to teach my mosaic garden pole workshop. Um, I have eight students today, and this is kind of some samples of the idea of what we're going to be doing. Of course, in my workshops, everybody creates their very own design. Um, we're using PVC pipe, which I cut into 30 inch lengths. That was quite a job. And these fabulous stands. Uh, fabricated just for me for my workshop by G&G uh, Welding in Westfield, Indiana. Shout out. They're perfect. They're nice and heavy. That way, uh, if you wanted to display your garden pole um, on your deck or your patio, you can. And here's some of the tessera we'll be working with. Lots and lots of different doodads. Lots of color, 7 8 inch bit. Lots of mirror, crystal glass. Um, these are interesting. These are uh, cut up terrazzo floors. Um, more doodads, penny rounds. Um, more doodads. <laughs> Choices are endless. And of course, we can never have enough silicone. So this should be a fun workshop. And I promise that I will post pictures and try to take some videos along the way. Their stations are all set up with the cutting tools, uh, nippers, running pliers, uh, glass scores. Of course, we need lots of measuring tapes and uh, rulers to make sure that we set the glass nice, evenly, and nice on the totem poles. So, um, looking forward to today. Should be fun. All right, this is take two. Uh, <laughs> this is the first day of the Mosaic Garden Pole Workshop, and everybody's really gotten a lot done. And I have to show you Jeanette's because it's just absolutely beautiful. Um, started at the bottom, and look at those pretty glass cuts, and this color combination of teal, baby blue, and lilac is just beautiful. And uh, at the top, um, she hasn't decided what she's doing yet, but um, something wonderful. Maybe like a little gazing ball or something. Yes. And uh, Elizabeth is doing funk E. I like it. <laughs> but that's the whole idea of this thing. It's um, and to create something really bright and colorful in your garden. And Jeannie is blowing us away with these beautiful glass cuts. This is all art glass that she's cut in thin strips. And isn't this a beautiful progression? It's very sophisticated, and it's an architectural design, I say. And Miss Christine, look at this. Isn't this fun? Look at these little fan mm -hmm. things here. And this is one of her first mosaics. This is her first mosaic workshop here, so I'm pretty impressed. She's oh, doing you. great. And I'll get you back. That's my sample that I'm working on. And Miss Robin, as usual, perfection. She's a little slower than everybody else, but Just that a is uh, Just a <laughs> not a surprise. <laughs> and Sheila... I love this. You have to see the topper that she's found. This is a, this, this ceramic cabbage or I don't know what it was from. Was this a Goodwill find? Yeah. yeah. Amazing. Mm -hmm. So that was kind of her inspiration for her garden pole. And Caitlin, once again, almost at the finish line. You are working fast. <laughs> Look at these cuts. Isn't this beautiful with the uh, teal colored mirror and the granite mirror that she's cut? And I wanted to show you what we've been using a lot of, and that's Play-Doh. And Play-Doh kind of helps create um, a bed, uh, a line, so the tessera doesn't move around on you until, it's, uh, until it sets up. So, wow, pretty amazing. Um, we work again tomorrow afternoon, and then Monday evening is grout night. This is Grout Night, the third session of the uh, Garden Mosaic Pole Workshop, and it's a real mess in here, but we love being messy. So um, I'm over the shoulder here looking at Jeanette's beauty, and she is working with a dental tool, getting any extra adhesive off that is where it shouldn't be, and, and she's pretty neat. And Miss Elizabeth here is working on this beauty. She hasn't grouted it yet, but I, I showed you these birds the last time. And <laughs> Jeanette, look at this. Oh, I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Here's Thank the you. architectural one. Look at this. The Yay. black grout on here is so fabulous. 
Very happy with it. And Miss Christine. Woo, look at this pop. Oh, wow. Yeah, all those wonderful colors. And here's that one I haven't finished. And <laughs> we won't look at that one. Yeah, look at the one I haven't finished. And this is just stunning. Of course it is. Look at these colors. I'll, and we, you know, we've got a lot of cleanup to do, but I'll take pictures of these when they're all polished and cleaned up and looking at their very best. Miss Sheila couldn't make it tonight, unfortunately, but this is going to be gorgeous. And look at this puppy. Caitlin. Woo! Shiny. And, oh, God, here's, I can't wait to see this growdy. This is the topper that's going on there. It looks like a, a circus tent top, doesn't it? <laughs> Isn't that wonderful? So um, when we're all cleaned up, we'll get them all polished and cleaned up this evening, and I will take the final pictures of these beauties.